Hey friend, welcome to my mini editing series on how to edit a vlog from beginning to end. In the previous episode, I showed you quickly how to start your first Premiere Pro project file and how to sort of tweak some settings to optimize it for the best experience while editing. And in this episode, I'm gonna show you how to quickly make a sequence for the footage that you're editing with. Okay, so let's go over to our project panel here and let's create our first sequence. This is pretty exciting stuff, guys. Uh, so if we go into our Sprinter Getting Stuck folder, we can see that it kind of imported it uh, exactly as we would expect to see it. So we can see our several cameras there. Uh, the easiest way to create a sequence is you select a clip and you drag it down here to this new item icon. And if you let go over that icon, it will automatically create a sequence out of that clip with the exact same settings as that clip. Uh, so then I would go and change the name of that sequence to the name of the vlog. So it's gonna be 01 Sprinter getting stuck. That is the simplest and quickest way to create a sequence. And the rule of thumb is if you have mixed media is you want your sequence that you're editing in to be the final resolution or the final format that you're uploading to the internet. So this is our sequence and I usually drag that up and drop it in the folder so it ends up at that top level there. And then I usually come down and select that first clip and then delete it right back out of the vlog. In my instance, I actually shot my A7S stuff at 60 frames per second. So I'm actually gonna go and I'm gonna modify those sequence settings real quick. So that way they have the frame rate I want them to be, which is 23,976. So I just changed that real quick there in my sequence because that's what I'm gonna deliver in. Okay, whew, take a deep breath. We're just about at the exciting stuff. So there we have it. Our project file is set up and now we can start importing our footage. Okay, friend, well, I truly hope you found that valuable and you learned a thing or two. I would really love it if you actually took the time to share this video series with a friend. You could open up a message right now and send them directly to leftcoast.co slash edit a vlog. I'd really appreciate that. It'd mean a lot to me. And uh, you could also join the collective if you want. It's my free newsletter where I send out all my videos early and all the adventure filmmaking content that I'm putting out in my uh, new tutorials. And the best part is, is you get direct access to me so you can email me any of your questions. So. Remember guys, until next time, life's better when you make stuff.